what's up guys so welcome back to the channel once again so again the special thanks to everyone who subscribed um, the subscriber base has grown tremendously and i appreciate it so yeah so once again i have another corolla and the first one was a beams and then obviously the 4 age 20 volt and today we have a very very nice conversion which is the 2zz so yeah, this Corolla is swapped to the 2ZZ GE, that's pretty nice and yeah, so without further ado, I'll take you through this with some cinematics and some tools and in the interview, so enjoy! So welcome to the channel. Sure, my man. So yeah, Ashley, we start this off by asking you why you bought this specific Toyota. So um, yeah, I was a 2012 guy all the years. Um, first car was a Corsa Bucky. Um, after that, it was three old specs, 2012s. And then when I sold my last new spec which I had, I saw this car come up uh, about two weeks later and my brother told me um, why didn't I buy it, went to go test drive the car was kind of happy with it and then yeah so I enjoy it at the moment that's my fun now so look um, I was always a Toyota guy uh, my wife my wife has a run RSI also and I found the enjoyment of driving it and then once I bought this car Look, I had lots of issues, but at the moment now, I'm very happy with where the car is. It's not a race car, it's my daily car. Um, it's fun. It's not fast, it's fun. Basically, I bought the car the 2ZZ in. Um, I have had the car about a year and I probably only drove it about a month. Having issues after issues. And then finally the motor broke. So I was deciding between dual beams and 2ZZ again. So I stuck with what I know and we went rather 2ZZ. Um, contacted Rifat and, and Sally. RSI performance and then they told they actually wired up the car and everything and then dropped it off by JVS for tuning so um, yeah the car is tuned by JVS the last dyno figures we did on the car was 154 and 208 newton meters yeah the car is running on the perfect power um, wired up and everything is done by Rifat, Moses and Sully yeah RSI performance basically so I'm very happy with where the car is at the moment. Um, I have no issues whatsoever. So Ashley, um, just tell us what they actually done on this motor. So basically the motor is stuck. There's nothing that has never been opened, just has an induction on with obviously the management that is running um, and it has the braided fuel lines so basically um, it has a branch on but the branch is actually underpowering the car and then it has a 63 mil power flow exhaust, one box, one rear box and then I tried something different with putting the induction out the front bumper uh, that's basically about it. So actually seeing that the beams option is like quite um, often used now in these cars, specifically the um, the Scarolas, what made you actually go the 2ZZ route? Look, I was considering between dropping the, after the first motor blew, I was considering between dropping the dual beams in. 
Mm. And then I actually looked at it and I thought, um, everything is there. And to the jet is different. It's different in this cars. It's not a common thing. I got nothing against the beams, guys. But to the jet is just different. The mm. VVT and the lift, it's, it's fun. I enjoy it. So have you actually had any issues with the uh, 2ZZ swap? No, I've actually had no issues besides the when we dropped the motor in and um, RSI performance mm. saw that the car never had a return fuel system up. So they did the fuel lines, um, they put a return system on and everything. Otherwise I've had no issues whatsoever. Basically this is the fuel rail that RSI performance had made up for me and then the braided fuel lines um, that's the management over there in the box uh, my fuel regulator and then this is my induction which I'm not done with yet it's, it's working for now okay, this is just the, it's the stock mountings um, from the RXI original mountings in there um, the mountings are just um, polyed all, all of the mountings uh, yeah a little vibration but nothing nothing too hectic sponsored a draggy device by draggy cpt so the device is capable of actually calculating accurately quarter mile times half a mile times eight mile as well as no 200 and unfortunately i wasn't able to record in car footage of the corolla but i do have the quarter mile results which ran a 13.9 second as well as the 0 to 100 time and 60 foot time. So if you are interested in purchasing a Draghi device, you are able to contact Draghi CPT on Instagram over any inquiries. <laughs> Do you actually plan to strip this car and race it on the track? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not one for stripping out cars. I will drive with full interior as it is now. The cars are daily. Uh, it has full interior, everything, door panels, seats, everything like that. Um, yeah, there's some people think I'm running gas. There's no gas bottles in here. The only <laughs> gas bottles will be for the stove. <laughs> so yeah, there's, it's full interior, no stripping of anything. When it comes to the track, um, we would like to see what the car is actually capable of. Um, Rifat Moses did actually check, test the car on the draggy. Um, the best time we got was 39, but the full interior stack wasn't even out. Um, that's the best time tire pressure not dropped. So we would like to see what the car would make on the track. So with regards to future plans, what, what do you plan on doing to the car? Um, look, at the moment the car is stock, as I, as I was saying, it's a stock motor. Um, future plans, um, bought an intake, um, a bit of branch, uh, lighten pulleys and uh, maybe a 76 mil throttle. And then we go back to tune and see what power the, the car makes. But uh, I want to have everything at one time put on and then we go tune, not piece by piece. Give us some advice for any subscribers who actually are interested in such a swap? Um, look, when it comes to doing the swap and stuff, I'm not the best of giving advice. But what I can say is, um, RSI Performance, Sully and Rifat, I would recommend them, wiring, motor-wise, everything. And then 2ZZ Nation also, which I'm part of. Um, Said, Felton, Gavin, um, Miley, you name, you name the rest, if I must your name, don't come and fight with me. But yeah, 2ZZ Nation has given me lots of advice and they keep on giving me advice. 
Um, so I'm grateful for all of that things, people who, who's helped me. So yeah, I would recommend you contact Tools of the Nation, you contact RSI Performance. Um, they're not going to they're not going to rip you off. They're gonna give you the best advice because most of the people has tried everything and they came out with the results.